Royal Wedding Coin is the most eagerly anticipated commemorative coin for a generation, and behind every coin struck by the Royal Mint is a designer. In this case, portrait sculptor Mark Richards. We chose Mark Richards uh, as one of the sculptors we wanted to be involved with uh, designing the Royal Wedding Coin because He's a specialist in portrait sculpture. His work is of a very fine quality. He produced effigies of the Queen in the past as well. And, and so when this project came up, when the Royal Wedding uh, coin came up at the back end of last year, I, I knew Mark had the ability to deliver a terrific likeness for us. And, and, and that's proven to be the case. So how do you go about designing a coin that everybody is waiting for? Let's meet the man himself. Mark, can you tell us a bit about the design process? Well, the first stage in the process is research, and, that, and in this case, it involved looking at a lot of film footage, um, some, a lot of photographs in magazines, newspapers, and generally trying to get a feel for them as a couple. And then, when an idea then develops, I start sketching. And in this case, I started sketching along the lines of a double portrait. And I was trying to capture that sense of an, int an intimacy and a real sense of friendship. Mm. So it's very important to me in the sense that they're real, they're sort of equals in friendship and love together. So. And I then make what's called a clay relief, um, and I make it quite, I make it to this size, which is about 300 millimeters across, and and I start modelling the image in clay. So can you say a bit about how you came up with this composition? Well, the, my thinking behind it was it was essentially to try and to well to make the portraits as equal on the um, on. On the, on the face of the coin as possible, so that they, they take up a sort of an equal amount of space. And then to place them so that the distance between the two heads is, suggests a sense that you've just caught a moment between them, that they're, they're not so close as they look as they're going to bump into each other, and not so far apart as they look distant, just to, to try and capture the relationship in a way happens as much in that space. The next step is turning this plaster cast into the real thing the official UK Royal Wedding coin. Watch this space to find out exactly how that happens.